Hey guys, it's Dawn with Dawn Southern Finds. Well, back at the booth. Guess I don't have to say it when you see all this behind me, right? So before I turn you around, remember, if you're new here, subscribe, like, comment, tell me what you think. Tell me what you would do different. So let me turn you around. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with Sabrina's booth today. So this is Sabrina's. She just added a bunch of these pieces. She's got these cool old water meter tops. I think they're from, um, hmm, I can't tell, Indiana. They're from Indiana. They're really cool. And, let's see, that giraffe is still sitting there, guys. She redid a little bit in her booth. And remember, during this video, if you see something you have to have, let me know. Because we can always ship it. She's got some really cool stuff. I know I've showed this bar that she did. She hand painted this. Very talented. Very cool. She makes these feed bags out of all feed containers. Uh, you know, bags. Okay, and then we'll turn around and go to my booth. So, I'm thinking about taking this container, putting a lock on it, and putting some higher-end jewelry. Let me know what you think about that. As I said before, crystal glass doesn't go real well, like plain glass. My favorite vase is still going. It may have to go into my new house. Josie's still here. Looks like I need a restock Josie. And this is like a, a nice view coming in. I don't know. This blocks a lot. We'll have to see. Let me know if there's something you would change. Because I'm always open to ideas. And sometimes I just get tired of looking at it. And I move things around. I flip-flop from side to side. I know I got a few ashtrays that sold. So I have all my ashtrays here. I try to do most of my brass here. These are some new additions. Those are old new stock I had gotten of the Cloisonne brass vases. I think it's time to redo this. It won't be today, but I'm going to come back and do something with these owls. They've been sitting there a while. Either move them around, adjust them, I don't know. So, let's see. I know I had some cobalt blue glasses here that's also. I moved this stuff over and extended my... Um, salt and pepper shakers and I got a bunch in that I had bought from Wendy so I put those in here and uh, that that I sold some Royal Albert today so and then of course this is my pride and joy I know it's not much but it is and I think they keep moving it So, it's a nice three-piece. And then my mom makes cemetery vases. So, I told her to bring a few in here. And, uh... So, I moved that, put that there for her. So, let me know if you would change anything. I think I'm going to change this whole set up 
although I like my clear glass in the window. Hmm. And this, I need to get like a, some kind of glass, I mean light, that I can mount under the shelf because there's a plug right behind me and that vase. So, and I think it's time to put a few things on sale that's maybe been hanging out for a while. So we'll see how that goes. I have to bring some more doilies and some more hankies I have at home. So I'll bring those. But overall, This is Halls. I don't know why I thought it was Lennox. Okay. And off we go to the front booth. Okay, here is the front booth. I'll start on this side. Jesus is still hanging up there watching. There's a lot more I have to do with this. It's hard to get a good video in here because it's such a tight space. I have a few empty pieces here. I need, I'm going to move some things from my other booth to here. And this one is not for me, so I'm going to return that to the front desk. That happens a lot. They take them and move them and decide that they don't want them. Some pens. My glass pendants aren't going very well. I need to make more earrings. I guess that will be on hold until further notice. So this is me in a nutshell here at, um, I just drew a blank, 61 Jump Street. So if you guys are in the area and want to check us out, stop by. We'd love to see you. Bye.